Hi guys. So if you're new here, my name is Nicole. I'm a licensed clinician and we're here talking about everyday things that impact our mental health and fitness, including the good stuff and ways to kind of try to move forward with the stuff that we would maybe rather not have happened or not have to deal with. Um, so one of those ways is actually something that I really enjoyed doing when I was doing it. It's, it's therapeutic gaming. So when I did it, I was running Dungeons and Dragons games for um, veterans with PTSD, m mostly. And it was really, really cool to see the growth that can happen in just six weeks of gaming. Now we had about three hours a week of active gaming and then an hour or two for processing. So it, it was a time investment for everybody for sure, um, but it was so worth it. And there's the reason why was because when you're creating your character, you can create them to be whatever you want them to be, right? So it's not just what you think would be appropriate for the campaign, but without even telling them what we were going to be doing, we had them think about like, what characteristics do I have right now? What do I want to turn up a little bit? What do I want to turn down a little bit? What do I want to try out? If I'm an introvert, do I want to try being an extrovert? Um, if I am fearful of the water, maybe my character can go into the river and I can see how I feel about that without actually me physically having to do it, right? So there's so many things that you can try. You can try on, you can try out. Um, if you're not a natural leader, you can have that opportunity to step up. Um, and it also gives you a lot of camaraderie. It not completely recreates, right? But like, um, it recreates some situations where, you know, maybe in the past, You've been in, let's say you're a veteran, right, for my group, um, combat situations. And then so you're, you're kind of creating this uh, reflection almost of what that was like. And then you can, you can have the time to sit down and process what just happened. So I highly encourage you if it's something that you've ever even thought about, maybe I want to learn how to do or, oh, I love doing this. This is fantastic. Um, there are therapeutic game masters who are running games who can certainly um, get you in one. So Google it, uh, therapeutic gaming, and whatever area you're in and see if you can find a group.